tonight, a Buffalo teenager is dead after a shooting that happened late last night in the Riverside neighborhood. Buffalo police say they were called to Esser Avenue just after 10 p.m. The 17 year old boy died at the scene. Investigators believe it was a targeted shooting and happened right outside a church. I spoke with the priest this afternoon. That's close to home, and that's what really is scary. Reverend Angelo Camaro was in bed just feet away from where police say a 17-year-old was killed Monday night on Esser Avenue. It happened right near All Saints Church. Camaro showed me security video from around the time of that shooting, showing someone running through the church parking lot. He ran down Shattuck towards Ontario. He tells me police were at the church Tuesday morning looking at this video and interviewing neighbors. They're going house to house asking anybody if they saw anything. And the police came and they, they roped off everything. The detectives were here this morning. We have cameras and they saw somebody running through the parking lot and down the street, down Shattuck. Police say this appears to be a targeted shooting. And then a 17 year old kid. I mean, that, that's what really is devastating. 17 years old, what a waste of life, my God. What, like I said, what else is there? What more can you do? As police investigate, neighbors hope the violence stops. I uh, hear gunshots all the time. You do? You hear a lot of gunshots? Not every day, but uh, sometimes. Can't tell the difference between the fireworks and the gunshots. How long have you lived in this neighborhood? 40 years. You feel safe? No. Sad. It is. I mean, was it a, was it a uh, young guy? or? Yeah, 17 year old. Oh, God, he never even started his life. I called the Charter School for Applied Technologies, and they told me the 17-year-old victim was a student there. They did not want to comment on the case, but say counselors and social workers are available for students suffering from anxiety or sadness over the loss. Oh, it's devastating. A 17-year-old kid, his life is just beginning. Uh, uh, this lack of respect for life, I mean, this is nothing new, unfortunately. Kamara says over the years, the violence has forced many people out of the neighborhood and out of his church. There's drugs around here. You see that the mules on their bikes going around all the time. Uh, I think drugs has a lot to do with it. But to have it happen right here is pretty close to home. It's scary. I worry about that. He worries more young people are going to lose their lives to gun violence. What's worse than taking life? That's the end of the story. There's nothing else you can do after that. That's pure evil. And investigators are asking anybody, if you have any information about this shooting, please call police.